How good is this, eh? Look at that. I mean, there is a track just over there. We're probably going to see a bit of traffic, but I don't care because this is just a glorious location to eat something. The story of my life, isn't it? Stuck into the old angle. I've got some chicken here. Chicken legs. And you know why we've got chicken legs? Because we're going to cook Chook Amigo. You got it. Take a plate with us. The blue plate looks pretty this time. Corn chips, oil. I've probably forgotten something, but we'll come back and get it. Chook Amigo is indeed a name that came from my mate Chooker, and I've got a feeling he might be here somewhere because I can hear the police helicopters. You'd hear Chooker, he drives a patrol, you can hear the rattles from about, oh, you know, the next town just about. Chooker came around, helped me cut off the back of Milo. And two reasons. One was because he knew there was always a lot of Forex in the fridge. And I did it after work, you know. And the second reason was because he figured if, I, if he left me on my own, I'd just knock it up real quick and, you know. His major concern wasn't the sides, because they're straight. It was the roof, getting that angle right. Because he knew that there was a fair chance all I'd do is just chop it straight off and fill it in. And you know what? I had a plan to chop it straight off and fill it in. But Chugger came around and we spent hours chalking lines and jigsawing and making it all fit together. He's a very clever guy. Okay, now, drumsticks. Taco seasoning. Your choice, this one's a mild one. And that, I can assure you, is an accident. I would normally go for the hot one. But, something happened. There we go. Taco seasoning is a mixture of um, various tomato type things and cumin, which is an amazing spice, and something else. I don't know what the other thing is. I think it might be a little bit of chilli. Have to be some chilli in it, wouldn't it? It smells like it. Bit of oil in the pan. Let that heat up. It's not going to take very long, I can tell you. Okay, so there it is, you can see. A couple of chicken legs. Taco spice. So far it's rating about 1 out of 10 in the complexity caper, alright? And then into the oil. I haven't got that much oil in there. Because I'm going to be turning it a fair bit. Might start by turning the pan down a bit. This thing really does pump some heat, honestly. I got it from BCF if you're looking for one. I think they're probably the only people that have them, I'm not sure. <coughs> oh, I don't know what restaurant they serve these in, but it's a good one. This is one meal, whenever you cook chicken, you've got to make sure it's cooked all the way through, okay? You can actually see chicken cook, it goes white as it goes through the flesh. And you can kind of judge it, you can go, okay, well it's just about there, it just needs to cook it in close to the bone. Give it another couple of minutes and it should be right. I'll just leave them to uh, happily sit there on their own. You can't really have Mexican without a few additions, eh? And sour cream has to be number one on the list. It's definitely ready. Look at that. Perfect. Too easy once you know how. And that, folks, is Chucamigo. Avocado, salsa, sour cream, corn chips, and chicken, lightly oiled, rolled in a bit of taco seasoning, and fried up. How good's that? Good enough to eat. Okay, you can go now. I'll sort this out myself.